Hi kids, in this video I am going to discuss about concept keyword in csf.net. So at here when we are using the concept keyword. So at here when the terms comes at here pointer. Okay, so at here this is the S term that is the pointer concept. Then we have to use unsafe keyword. So at here, here I am getting the red passes at here getting unsafe code may only appear if compiling with unsafe and here this is the pointer sap is the one method method add here it has two parameter and that receive add a uh, pointer kind of values okay so if i execute so the code works properly there is no any problem with this code and here getting the output so at here this is the program for swapping so a10 b20 after swapping a20 b10 so that means our code is working fine so at here no need to worry about the red mark it's fine so what happened when we are not using on save keyword so let's uh, remove this part now here after let's uh, remove this part too so add here uh, with main there is no any red line but add here here I am getting to masses okay so if I take the cursor at this place getting the masses the masses here add here pointer and fixed size buffer may only be used in an unsafe context so when you are using add here pointer and fixed size buffer then at here method body it must include unsafe keyword after that you can use it now here the same problem with this place here pointer the same masses here I am getting here the same things and here same things so when you are dealing with the pointer concept then you must include unsafe keyword so I'm going to do the undo. So let's use unsafe. Now uh, inside code there is no any problem, but only the masses here it's with the main. So since we are using unsafe code, so that here in main method read or uh, current. Now here after let's uh, include unsafe with the swap method. Now here only swap method has read and the error that out and if i execute this code so there is no any problems here right so displaying the correct output so this is the program there i am using a uh, swap map swap to number so add here i have taken integer tab variable 10 b 20 and here so add here if you are using ampersand so ampersand is used for address so add here it will take the address of a that store into x address of b that go into y now here after console dot write so ab values 10 20 here x and y so x that all comes to this by x and y and here after p dot sam so here that come and here so add here at this place address so here a address has 10 values and b address has 20 values so add here 10 20 10 20 and here this 10 go to dmp and here key value is now 20 20 go to uh, p and here after dmp q here after that swap and here after win that back so the output that is display 20 and 10 so add here or uh, ampersand is used for address and here if you are using a star okay so that is used for add here value so add here when you are dealing with the uh, uh, pointer concept then you must include answer keyword after that you can use the pointer in csr.net so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next video thank you